God bless everyone. This is the prophet. I thank God for all of you being with us this evening. And I want you to know that God loves you. Uh, and God wants to bring you to such a beautiful expected end. And I know that God is going to do something phenomenal for us this evening. I want you to share this. Let somebody know that the prophet is live and God is going to prosper you Amen. and increase you. Uh, it's going to be such a short message, but it's going to be extra deep. And then I'm going to share some insight on, um, I'm going to share some insight on, uh, on the church where we are, what are the last things we need, and uh, God is going to move in a miraculous and mighty way. Amen. Amen. I want to thank all of you for standing with me in this vision and understanding that this vision is given to us all. Mm. And I know the Lord Jesus will be glorified. So I want you to let somebody know that the prophet is live. And I will honor those who are giving today Amen. and those who gave yesterday. And I will just mention some people's names when we are done. But for now, I want us to go into a deep teaching. Amen. I've been teaching about, I, I, the last time I taught about the faith that works, and that was the fundamentals of faith. Mm. It was the groundwork of faith. Today I'm going to push it a little higher. I want to see all those on YouTube, please hit the thumbs up. If you don't hit the thumbs up, I'll just go offline. Okay. There won't be any point. I want you to appreciate God by allowing other people to also find this video, to Amen. be blessed by it. So hit the Amen. thumbs up whether you're on YouTube, whether you're on Facebook, and the Lord Jesus will bless you and increase you. I want you to do that as fast as you can, and, and the Lord will be glorified. Share this. Amen. Let somebody know. La Rabashataya. Telibia Amoranda Dabayakata. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Are, are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? If you're ready and you're excited, this is going to be deep. Amen. I'm going to teach you how to know if you have faith. Mm. Amen. Amen. What is the evidence that you have faith? Okay. Wow. Amen. The Bible says it is impossible to please God without faith. The last time I was teaching you the fundamentals of faith, why you need faith, how faith operates. And I separated and I taught you that the word of God is not faith, but the word of God is the conduit in which you receive faith. Mm. It is the carrier of faith. Yes. But scriptures themselves are not faith. Mm. I wish Amen. somebody could hear me. Can we turn off Amen. the cold anointing, please, sir? Labaya, this is about to be nice. Amen. Amen. I'm Amen. actually excited. Yes. Actually, do you want to read? Can we give her the other microphone, please? Okay. Uh, uh, so we have two people. One great grace and one Elias <laughs> generation. Amen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> ah, ah, it's about to be too much. Amen. I want us to go to the book of James. The book of James, chapter 2. <laughs> Elin, are you okay? Yes. <laughs> High five. Let you me see me. if you're okay. Yes. God I'm is good. Very okay. James, chapter 2. <laughs> and I want you to read verse 14. Amen. James, chapter 2. And I want you to read verse 14. James 2, 14. Yes. What doth it profit? Mm -hmm. My brethren, though a man say he had faith and have not works, can faith save him? Stop right there. Read it one more time. Now listen to this. Listen to this. Uh, please read it with uh, much more oomph and power. Yes, Papa. Yes. The fire of Elijah. <laughs> I need to feel it. Amen. Uh -huh. What doth it profit? My brethren, mm -hmm. though a man say he had faith and have not works, can faith save him? Stop right there. Meaning that this is what James is saying. What does it profit a man, brethren, to say that they have faith without works? Mm. And that faith cannot save them. Yes. Please read it one more time. What doth it profit, uh -huh. my brethren? Meaning faith must profit you. Mm. Somebody, who have, somebody who's a carrier of faith, yeah. faith must be a prophet. Wow. Somebody is not listening wow. to me. Yes. Faith ought to be a prophet. Mm -hmm. 
Wow, wow, Somebody wow. who is possessing faith must profit from their own faith. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish somebody could yes, hear me. Yes, Jesus was a benefactor of what he was carrying. Yes. You cannot say you have faith and it doesn't benefit you first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Faith must be a profit to the believer Amen. because whoever possesses faith has the ability to please God. And if God Amen. is pleased, God will give you anything that you want. Amen. So faith is a profit. So anybody who tells you that they have faith, but that faith does not profit them, Amen. that person has no faith because faith is a profit. Wow, Amen. that's good. I wish somebody could hear me. Somebody type, faith is a prophet. Faith is a prophet. I can hear you. Faith is a prophet. Faith is a prophet. Say it with everything new. Faith is a prophet. Faith is a prophet. Faith must benefit you. Wow. If what you have you call faith, but it has no benefit, it's not faith. Amen. It's belief. Ay, ay, ay. It's belief. Believing wow. leads you into faith. How? Because believing makes you obsess over something. Mm-hmm. That is why uh, I'm sorry to use him. He's probably not the best example in society right now. I won't mention his name, but you'll understand. He sang this song. I believe I can fly. Yeah. Yeah. I believe I can touch the sky. <laughs> I think about it every night and day. <laughs> Spread my wings and fly. Because when you believe, yeah. you can do the impossible. Why? Because believing makes you obsess. Mm. Right. Mm-hmm. That's good. You are not saved by belief. You are saved by what? Faith. Faith. Mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But the Bible says, if you believe Jesus, if you believe that Christ was born of a virgin, you believe that he is Lord, you believe this, you believe that, you believe this, you believe that, then... When you confess him, then you receive him. Mm. That's good. Even though believing is beneficial, mm. but it does not have the same benefit as faith. Mm. Mm. Because wow. believing is not faith. Mm. Wow. Ay, ay, ay. Wow. I feel like I'm yeah. talking to you myself. Listen, Can somebody check the, the puppies, please? Karabadabayata. Amen. Faith mm. is a prophet. Yeah. Faith is a prophet. Mm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I wish somebody could hear me. Yeah. Listen, Amen. Papa. Faith mm. is a prophet. Amen. Mm. Where there is faith, people will profit. Mm. Amen. Amen. Yeah, that's good. My gifts benefit my people. Because I don't only have the gift, I have the faith to operate the gift. Amen. Mm -hmm. Because no gift operates without faith. There is nothing you ever do that is from God, that is with God, Uh that is given to you without faith. Wow. Mm -hmm. I cannot benefit you with the prophetic if I don't have the faith for the prophetic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I cannot benefit you with deliverance if I don't have the faith that operates deliverance. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Faith is such a profit to the extent that if you carry faith, you no longer need to pray for things. Mm. Yeah. Amen. You make those things happen. Amen. Amen. Because faith removes control from God, it puts control in your hands. Wow. 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 So good. Wow. wow. Amen. Faith removes control from God, it puts it in your hand. Yeah. God's desire is for you to develop faith so that you don't disturb him for things that are obvious. Yeah. Wow. Somebody didn't hear what I just yes. said. Yeah. Very true, Papa. Hello. Hello. You know, there are people that God is not interested to heal. Mm. Wow. Wow. Mm. I'm sorry to say it. Mm. Jesus died for everyone, but he's not going around obsessed about healing everyone. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah. My God. I, I don't know if you hear me. Yeah. Listening. <laughs> mm-hmm. Let's go to the Bible. Amen. Acts chapter 3. You are going to read it. Okay. Elias generation, you read this one. Acts chapter 3, mm-hmm. verse 1. Acts 3, verse 1. Uh-huh. Now Peter and John went up together. I love the oomph. Go again. One more time. <laughs> <laughs> now Peter and John went up together into the temple at the hour of prayer. Uh, at the hour of what? Prayer. prayer. Uh-huh. 
being the ninth hour. Being the ninth hour. Amen. And a certain man lame from his mother's womb was carried. Whom there, they there is a man who, I'm sorry to, to put a pause on you, my daughter, but listen to this. There was a man who was born crippled. Mm -hmm. He was born like that. From his mother's womb. Mm -hmm. Start over, please. Verse 1. Mm -hmm. Now Peter and John went up together into the temple at the hour of prayer, mm -hmm. being the ninth hour. Mm -hmm. And a certain man lame from his mother's womb was carried, mm -hmm. whom they laid daily at the gate of the temple, which is called Beautiful. Hold on there. The man was at church every single day. Mm. God never bothered to heal him. Mm. Wow. Wow. Until the guy no longer prayed for miracles, wow. the guy just wanted gold and silver. Jesus. Wow. The man was at the temple every day. Pastors passed by. Mm -hmm. Bishops passed by. Evangelists passed by. Archbishop passed by. Cardinals passed by. Mm -hmm. Every single of anointing you can think passed mm -hmm. by. The man was still asking for silver and gold. Yeah. Wow. Let me ask you a question. Yes. Do you pray to go to Starbucks? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Huh? No. Why don't you pray to go to Starbucks? Because you have the ability to produce. Yeah. Yeah. When you go to Starbucks, you can say, give me this and you can get yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, wow, wow, yeah. Wow, wow, yeah. wow. You don't pray for it. Yet the Bible says, acknowledge God in all your ways. Why don't you pray for that? Because this is no longer something you can disturb God for. Mm. Yes, yes, wow, yes. Wow, wow, wow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's good. It is no longer something that is about God anymore. Right. It My is about God. you wanting Starbucks. God is not coming to tell you, do you want Starbucks? I will provide. Yeah. <laughs> Notice you ask God for things that are beyond your control. Yeah. yeah. But even what you think is beyond your control, God has placed a system that it should be in your control. Mm. So here is a man that is at the temple every day at the church. Silver gold. Silver gold until it became a song. Silver gold. <laughs> Silver gold. <laughs> every day, same place. The Holy Spirit, and remember there was an angel that went into the, water, into the temple, stared the waters. The guy never got healed because he never even went in there. The guy is at the temple every day. Listen to this. Keep reading. Um, they laid him, they laid daily at the gate of the temple, which is called beautiful, to ask alms of them that entered into the temple. To ask alms, meaning he was not the only one. There was a few of them. Mm. Keep going. Mm. Who seen Peter and John about to go into the temple, asked an alms. They told, saw Peter and John, they said, uh, can we have gold or silver? They were very specific in what they wanted. Mm -hmm. Keep going. And Peter, fastening his eyes upon him with John, said, Look mm -hmm. on us. Mm -hmm. And he gave head unto them, mm -hmm. heed unto them, expecting to receive something of them. Look at this. Stop right there. Peter looked, said, Hey, look at me. The man looked, said, ah, I'm about to receive the best mm -hmm. donation I've ever received in my life. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you the biggest lie that people have been told. Mm. You need faith to be healed is mm. a lie. Wow. Wow. Mm. wow, 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 wow. You need faith to heal yourself. Mm. Mm. But if you're going to a man who says they are a man of power and they need your faith to heal you, then they're not the ones healing you. Mm. You're healing yourself. Wow. That's really good. Mm. I'll say that again. Mm. <laughs> people say Jesus healed people. In reality, Jesus healed very few people. Yeah. Because whoever came to him, he made them use their own faith. Mm. And when they used their faith, he reminded them, your faith has made you well, not my faith. Right, wow. right, yeah. His faith came into play when you could not use your own. Yeah. Wow. And whenever he used his faith, he rebuked them because that's not why he came. Jesus came to revive your own faith. To understand that I have put something inside of you that can fix this issue that you keep knocking at heaven every day. Mm -hmm. yeah. So when people come to him, you say, do you believe? You say, Lord, I believe. You say, then go, your faith has made you well. Mm -hmm. wow. He will never say, now I release healing. You say, your faith has healed you. Your own faith, not my faith. Mm -hmm. 
When, the, when they demanded of his faith, what would he say? How long will I be with you, faithless generation? When the son of man will come, will he find faith in the earth? Hey. Meaning God is looking for faith Amen. to be in yeah. men. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's good. That's good. Mm. Wow. wow. God is looking for faith to be in what? Men. That man is a man of faith. It is true. There are times that God has made me invoke my own faith to, to help people. Wow. Blind people by the Amen. grace of God. Mm -hmm. Deaf people by the grace of Amen. God. Sick people by the grace of God. I have done that. But it is not what God really wants. Yeah. Because God doesn't want you to be dependent on anybody. Yeah. Yeah, he wants yeah. you to be dependent on him. Yeah. But the dependence is so that he can give you something that you can manage. And then he gives you another thing that you can manage. And you go from glory to glory mm. to glory. Amen. But we have such a weak Christianity that... If God feels like he will heal me, mm -hmm. if it is God's desire to heal me, then he will heal me. God made his desire clear. God made his intentions clear That's good. when Jesus died on the cross. That's good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He will not repeat himself. Amen. He made it available for everybody. Yes. Yes. But not yeah. everybody will get healed. Why? Because either their own faith is not is non-existent, mm -hmm. it has withered away or it has died, mm -hmm. or somebody with great faith did not encounter them. Mm. Mm. That's good. Because out of everybody that was coming into the temple, no one ever offered mm. the man at the beautiful gate healing. Mm -hmm. Wow. Maybe they prayed for them. That God have mercy and heal this person. Yeah. But here comes Peter. What does Peter say? Listen to this. Then Peter said, silver and gold have I none. Listen, it was clear. If you're looking for silver and gold, mm -hmm. I don't have it. He did not say John also. Yeah. He said, me, Peter, I don't have silver and gold. Mm -hmm. Meaning John wanted to pass. Mm -hmm. He said, look at me, me, silver and gold, I don't have. Mm -hmm. Then what does he say? But such as I have give I thee. What such as I have, what I have, I am giving you now. Wow. So meaning this miracle was not for God to give, it was for who to give? Peter. Yeah, Peter yeah, yeah. chose to give. Amen. Amen. Wow. Wow. I, I feel like I'm talking wow. to myself yeah, now. That's good. Wow. Peter is the one who is deciding. What I have, I am up. I wish more hey, people would push on. thumbs yeah. up. Yeah. I, I'm push, looking push. at YouTube and I'm, I'm, I'm kind of heartbroken oh, right now. Like, I'm like, seeing like. so many views, but the thumbs up are less. I need those thumbs up yes, right yes. now. Even it out. Whether you're on Facebook or you're on YouTube, I need those thumbs up. Yes. Amen. Come on. Mm. So good. Mm -mm. Mm. This uh, great... Uh, Armenian coffee is hitting the spot today. Anush, I'm enjoying Papa. it. Anush, I mm -hmm. receive. I receive. Gracias. <laughs> <laughs> I need those thumbs up. We ca the thumbs up need to match the views. Amen. So I'm waiting for those people that are alive to match those thumbs up. We can't be over 300 and the thumbs up are only at 200. No. Uh, uh, yes. You know, already know what to do. You're in the spirit, sir. I don't know if somebody can hear me. Yes. Yes. Listening. Amen. Glory be to the, to the Lord Jesus. Glory be to the Lord Jesus. I need those thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. I need those thumbs up. I need those thumbs up. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. I'm waiting for those thumbs up to, to, to increase. La brada bayakata. Amen. Lord Jesus, you're worthy of all praise. You're Amen. worthy of all adoration. Yes, Lord. Mm. I'm just waiting for people. When, when you're ready, you have hit the thumbs up. I just want you to type fire so that we can keep going. Amen. Thank you, Lord.
Thank you, Lord Jesus. Kabara bada bayata tata dabaya kaka. Ribanda dabaya kata la baya katuria mada baya kata. Zipara bara bara baya kata. Zipre de bedi bia amakuria tabayaka. Zipora makuda apra katigia amasonte te bedi biaba. Rapaka kata yaba baba kata yaba. Zipara bara 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 baya ati di di biaba kata kata ya. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Mendere de de beatush. Mekora, mekora, mekora baya. Let me see you too. If you're ready, just type fire. Yeah, it's okay, son. You can deal with those later. Thank you, Lord. Let's see. Let's see. If you're ready, just type fire. Ah, YouTube, YouTube, you're letting me down. A few people are still not are still Eish. not doing it. Uh, I'm waiting on, for you. Come on, fam. I'm waiting for you. We'll just pray grace, and you'll not get. We will not get where God wants us to get to, and it's okay. We can move on. And, uh, you know, I don't like coming live and I won't leave anything behind that will benefit Eish. people. Mm. Yeah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Mm. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. I'm just Thank waiting you, for those thumbs up. Amen. And Amen. then we continue. Yes. Thank you, Lord. We're just waiting for those thumbs up. Amen. Pekaro, pekaro, pekaro. Pekaro dia amaru likato para para katia tabayata. Zepere berebe dia amaru kia sevente perevia. Amen. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Okay, I see more people. Those who have done it, uh, those who have done it, uh, type fire again, type fire, fire type fire, fire, type fire. 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 I need this, this thumbs up to match, to really match what is happening. Amen. The greatest lie you are ever told is that you're waiting for God to heal you. Mm. Wow. Wow. Is you're waiting for God to give you breakthrough. It is because you have not, it's like I'm waiting for a six pack to come. <laughs> <laughs> I'm eating Burger King every day, <laughs> McDonald's every day. <laughs> uh, you know yourself, confess. <laughs> maybe, maybe Auntie Erica will start doing something different and help somebody. But we, what, what we, what we <laughs> Bishop, are you okay? <laughs> Why are you looking down? <laughs> are, you, are you caught up in worship? <laughs> I'm just gonna wait for God to do something. I promise you before God. Yeah, yeah. Jesus did everything. Come on, Papa. Mm. Yeah. Genesis chapter uh, Great Grace. I want you to stay in the no no great grace will read this one. Uh, Genesis chapter 2 verse 1. The last generation you, you, you are fine right there. Genesis. <laughs> chapter 2 verse 1. Amen. Mm -hmm. Thus the heavens and the earth were finished and all the host of them. Stop right there. Thus the heavens and the earth were finished and all the host of them. Everybody that was going to come on earth existed. You may think you were born in 1996, you may think you were born in 1990, you may think you were born in 1990, you may think you were born in 82, you may think you were born in 84, you yeah. may think you were born in 87, or even 79 or 78, mm. or 1960. Mm. The truth is, you were created the same day Adam was created. Hey. Wow. Jesus. Wow. That is the truth. Wow. The problem is, or not the problem, the difference is, is your spirit was sent on earth mm -hmm. in 1990. But your existence began when Adam was created. Mm. Wow. wow. That is the reality. Yeah. When you are sent on earth is a different time. Yeah. 
When you are created, every human being was created at the same time. Mm. Mm-hmm. Every single human being was created at the same time. And everything that every human being will ever need was also given to them. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mm. Read it again. Uh-huh. Thus the heavens and the earth were finished, uh-huh. and all the hosts of them. Uh-huh. And on the seventh day, God ended his work, which he had made. Mm -hmm. And he rested on the seventh day from all his work, which he had made. And God blessed the seventh day and sanctified it. Mm -hmm. Because that in it, that in it, he had rested from all his work, which God created and made. Stop right there. God, every day you see Saturday is a reminder that what you've been working for already exists. Wow. 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 Oh my Amen. Goodness. Wow. <laughs> Every day you see Saturday. <laughs> that's, that's deep. Is yeah. a reminder that God rested. God is not working. God is wow. not going to create a job that he did not already give you from the beginning. Jesus. Amen. God is not giving you a husband that was not already destined from the beginning. Wow. God is not giving you things that he did not already destined for you. Wow. Amen. All these things were already predestined. Yeah. Yeah. They were already there. So God is seated. Have you ever heard that God is not sitting on his throne? Every scripture you read that is pertaining to God is saying God is sitting down. Yeah. Somebody who is sitting down is somebody who, is, somebody who says, I am resting yeah. mm-hmm. from all my work which I created and made. Mm-hmm. Creating is the designing process. Mm-hmm. Making mm-hmm. is the manufacturing process. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's designed good. in America, made in China. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. Designed in China, made in Taiwan. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. Assembled in India. <laughs> yeah. If you hear yeah. creating and making, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. two different processes completely. Yeah. God is confirming that He created and made everything, and is resting. Mm-hmm. That is why God is not creating bread. Wow. When the children of Israel asked for, for bread, bread fell from heaven. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Where there is no bakery, but there was bread that fell. Jesus. Because there is no idea that you have on earth that is not already existing. Mm. Let me be honest with you. Electricity is not a new invention. Mm. Yeah. Do you understand that every technological advancement we have mm-hmm. is an enhancement of what we have in the environment? Hey. Mm. Mm. Electricity was always there. Yeah. But it's a few people like Tesla and uh, what was the other guy's name? Phillips. Uh, um, the, the guy who, is it, uh, which other guy? Thomas Edison. It, uh, Edison. They are the guys who, who found a way to harness that power. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But the power of electricity always existed. Wow. So somebody was saying, we made electricity. No, you did not. Mm-hmm. You just captured it. Mm. That's yeah. good. Because it was already there. There is nothing we are making from scratch, zero. Mm. Right. Wow. Hmm. Every time lightning was passing, that's electricity. Yeah. <laughs> wow. This is an engineer we have here. He knows what I'm talking about. He knows electricity as it is. It is already energy that existed. Now everyone is like, oh, we want clean energy. Mm. Clean energy was always there. Who was going to create solar to capture it? The sun has been giving energy from day one. So none of these things are new. We just have advanced enough to make use of what has been given to us. When your faith matures, you begin to make use of what God has already made. Amen. Somebody Amen. didn't hear what I yeah, said. Somebody didn't hear what I said. Yeah. When your faith matures, yes. you begin to make use of already what is available. Yeah. 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 Amen. 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 God won't come and give you electricity. Yeah. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He won't do that. So the man at the beautiful gate, Peter looks at him. What does Peter say? Then Peter said, silver and gold have I none. Uh But such as I have, give I thee. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, rise up and walk. Notice, did he pray? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. What did he do? He said, what I have, I'm giving you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it was not even God had no play in the decision of him giving him. Wow. If you ever see a man of God saying, uh, I need to hear the Holy Spirit if I should pray for you, he's a false man of God. Wow. Wow. Uh, some people won't like that, but I'm telling you the truth. Hey, 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 hey. That's good. If you possess faith, it has nothing to do with God. Yeah. Wow. 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 That's good. Amen. 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 Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, know some, hey. I know I just stabbed somebody. <laughs> Please. 
uh, don't hate the messenger. <laughs> it is not me. Uh, <laughs> help us, God. Mm -hmm. It's, it's better to say, I'm not sure if I should pray for you. Mm -hmm. But don't say, I'm waiting for the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. The Holy Spirit already made his intention clear. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Jesus going on the cross is clear that God removed every stumbling block to keep you from what he has already made available for you. Mm -hmm. wow. Amen. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm talking to myself. I need more people to share this. Yes, good. Amen. Hmm. Hello. Hello. Uh, is somebody there? Yes. If you can hear me, just type fire. 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 If you can hear me, type fire. Fire. Wow. It's a lie. People came to Jesus and said, Jesus. Somebody has died. Jesus did not say, let me wait and see if my father wants me to do it. <laughs> Jesus, if he was compelled, he went and did it. If he right. was not compelled, he would not do it. Right. Wow. Right. Don't you understand? When somebody says, oh, let God use you, it's a lie. Mm -hmm. wow. Oh, God, let God. I, 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 so I've heard people pray this in church. And it just makes me laugh because it's the most useless prayer you can ever offer. Father, when, when Elin preaches today, let her not be in the picture. Let you be the one speaking. Yeah. It's the most <laughs> foolish prayer you can ever pray. Because no man can speak of God without their experience of God. Hey, wow. Yeah. Wow. That's good. It's a lie. Wow. These are false doctrines, I'm telling you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They're false doctrines. John the Baptist said, let me decrease so that he may decrease, increase. Yeah. Yeah. What he was saying is that let me be out of the picture. Now it is his time. Yeah. Amen. More of you, Lord, less of me. Amen. What he was saying is that, Lord, let you be seen. Why would Paul say, follow me as I follow Jesus? Mm -hmm. mm. Right. When people tell you, just follow God, there are people who have no faith. They cannot show you God. So they tell you, go find him for yourself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. Don't put it on me for you to find God. Because they can't produce, they'll say, just figure God out for yourself. Wow. Wow. There is no one who went to Moses and say, and Moses said, go find God. Moses will say, I will show you God. Hey. He will demonstrate God. Hey. You go to Elijah, he will call fire to prove you yes, God. Yes, yes. Where did this doctrine come of, uh, 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 show me God, go find God for yourself. Right. Right. Uh, uh, it's demonic, it's a lie. Yes. Wow. You know, That's the problem good. is common sense is not so common anymore. Right, yes. yep. Mm. Mm. Help us. Wow. Yeah. People don't even have sense anymore. Maybe pennies. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to myself. I feel like I'm speaking to myself. I feel like I'm speaking to myself. If you are there, shout fire. Fire! If you are there, shout fire. Fire! Ah. <laughs> I don't know if somebody's listening. Uh, yeah. Papa. Yeah. This is the major question. This is the major question. This is the major question. Mm. Mm. I'll say it again. Mm. This is the major question. Mm. Mm. This is the major question. Where is your faith? Mm. Why would Jesus ask them? The disciples are with him in the plane. Yeah. They, they in, I said the plane. <laughs> you know we are in, 20, we are in the 20th, 21st century. Jesus is in the boat. <laughs> hey, if it was the plane, they would have died. <laughs> he just did this. <laughs> They're in the boat. The waves are hitting the boat. Water is being filled in the boat. Right. Yes. Huh. They notice Jesus is not even flinching. Yeah. No doubt. <laughs> you know and sleep is nice you 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 know you are sleeping but you stretch yourself you, know, mm, you settle in even better 
you know why I'm saying Jesus was too comfortable? Because they said he was sleeping in the lower part of the boat, knocked out. Mm. The water is being filled in the boat. Jesus is knocked out. They woke Jesus up. They said, Lord, don't you care that we die? It means that water was hitting him, but he was knocked out. Mm. Wow. wow. For somebody to tell you, hey, imagine you're driving. Mm. And somebody's just about to bang something. You'll be like, hey, yeah. Yeah, yeah. what are you doing? You don't, you want us to die. Yeah. Yeah. That is what they did. And they say, hey, sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah. I was distracted. Mm -hmm. They are telling Jesus. They didn't even say, Lord, the winds are too strong. Do something. They literally said, Lord, don't you care that we die? Yeah. Meaning even he looked like he was about to drown. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you have to use imagination when you're reading scripture. Yeah. Amen. For somebody to tell you, don't you care that we die? It means that there is flooding yeah. because the Bible says there was water filling the boat. Yeah. It means even where Jesus was sleeping was wet. Wow. Mm -hmm. Never woke up, knocked out. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That they have to wake you up and say, Lord, all of them. Lord, don't you care? You don't care that we're about to drown. Some of us can't walk on water. <laughs> Why are you not caring that? Are you ready to go to heaven? Because we are not understanding. It bothered them yeah. that Jesus got annoyed. How do we know Jesus got annoyed? Because he never responded to them. He yeah. got up, went to the sea, said, you come down. And you wind, shh, everything came down instantly. Whoo. He turned and looked at them. Where is your faith? Went back to sleep. <laughs> Why did he say, where is your faith? Yeah. He did not say, why didn't you ask my father? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Use your common sense. Yeah. Come on, come yeah. on. Come he, on. Did, he did not say, why didn't you ask my father? Yeah. Why didn't you call wow. upon the angels? Wow. Why didn't you ask yeah. for the Holy Ghost? Mm -hmm. He said, where is your faith? Mm -hmm. Meaning what they were asking Jesus for they could do. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Wow. 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 99.99% of you are praying for things you can do. That is why My. God is not responding. Jesus. My goodness. Wow. 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 Some of you are like the story of the emperor with no clothes. I feel like I'm talking to myself. If you are there, type fire. To myself, fire. fire. I wish. Fire. I wish more people were, were sharing fire, this. Fire, fire, fire. Oh my Lord Jesus. This is the issue that people have now. This is the issue that we have. Is men and women. Yeah. Everything is, oh, I'm waiting for God. <laughs> oh, my time will come one day. What are you doing about it? Right. Read right. that verse again, great grace. Mm. Oh, you removed it, okay. Genesis 2? No, 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 no. Oh. Go back to James chapter James. 2. James. 14. Okay. <laughs> Elin Elias, let's go. Amen. <laughs> What that it profit? Uh -uh, you are laughing. <laughs> Let's give it oomph. Okay. <laughs> James chapter 2, 14. Uh -huh. What does it profit, my brethren, though a man say he had faith? And uh -huh. Keep going. And have not works? Uh -huh. Can faith save him? Notice. Why is James saying you need works? Now let me make this clear. There is works, and there is works of faith. Mm. Wow. I'm going to give you a distinction now. Yeah. Let me explain it to you so that you understand. Mm. God is not interested in your works, mm -hmm. but God is interested in works of faith. Mm. Wow. Let me give you an example. How many people know some Jehovah Witness that have knocked at your door? Yeah. Yes. Have you, they will come every day. They don't even right. know what they are talking about. <laughs> but they will be knocking every day. They will be there. Mm -hmm. yeah. They do that because they believe by doing that, they secure their place in the kingdom of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. So they are trying to earn their place in the presence of God, mm -hmm. which is a false doctrine. Mm -hmm. 
That is man's works. It's not works of faith. Because I am trying to impress God with what I can do. Yeah. Those works God is not interested mm. with because those works are like filthy rags. Yeah. Wow. Right. It's like somebody who's wearing rags, not filthy clothes, taking rags, mm -hmm. putting it on and saying, this is my best wear and I'm uh -huh. going to the White House. You will never be welcome. Yeah. 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 That's good. So anything you do trying to impress God, God is not interested in. Mm -hmm. God is impressed when you put work towards what he has ordained. Mm. Those are called works of faith. Yeah. Wow. If you believe God can heal mm. every day, even though you're sick, you wake up. Mm -hmm. I am healed. I am healed. Thank you, Lord, for restoring me. Every day you're mm -hmm. exercising that leg. You're exercising that arm. Mm -hmm. You're exercising that back. Yes, I yes. believe it. Mm -hmm. What you're doing is you're working the works of faith. Yes, 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 Those yes. works load up, they load up, they load up until your faith is complete. Yes. Amen. That the works Amen. and the faith have matched yes. up. Amen. You have energized your faith. Now it just happens that you just get up. Everybody is shocked. Wow. How did this happen? Amen. Amen. That's good. Remember the same Peter, they tried to cast out demons out of a person they failed. Yeah. yeah. They tried to heal some people at times they failed. Yeah. But they never stopped mm. until his faith was so perfected Amen. that his shadow could heal a sick yeah. person. Wow. Wow. I feel like I should stop. Yes. Let me, let me, I don't know if I should get out of here. It's too much. Jesus. Woo. It's too much. Hey. Yeah, yeah. That's good. The works of faith are necessary. Wow. Amen. That is why James is saying, what does it profit, mm. brethren, that a man would say that he has faith, yeah. but he has no works? Wow. So saying it, if you say, oh, I have faith, mm -hmm. but you have never, it's like saying, I want a six pack. You've never done any crunch, any sit up. Mm. <laughs> right. Burritos every day. <laughs> French fries every day, <laughs> Burger King every day, but you're saying six pack, <laughs> six pack, up here, up, 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 up here, up here. I see it in the spirit, even though you cannot see it. <laughs> it's somewhere underneath. You are deceiving yourself. Yes. The problem is Satan is not the only one that is deceiving people. People have deceived themselves. Wow. Jesus. And that one is worse than the devil deceiving you. Wow, wow, wow. Some people, it's like you have, de you have <laughs> I'm sorry to say this, don't judge me, but it's just I'm trying to explain it. I've been there myself. That's why I've gone back to working out. <laughs> you know you can deceive yourself so much, you see rolls and you think they're six pack. <laughs> And then if you tell them, oh, but <laughs> they'll say, stop judging me. <laughs> You're just a hater. Uh -uh. You know, the reason why we have some of the most unhealthiest people in our communities now is because you can't tell people the truth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And in order for you to have works of faith, you need truth. Mm. Mm. Amen. I've seen some people pray and I tell them, you know, you're praying the wrong way. They'll say, oh, well, God speaks to me the way he speaks to me and how you deal with God is different. There's only one way to deal with God. It's in the scriptures. Yeah. Amen. 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 <laughs> I need more thumbs up. I need more thumbs up because on, I am up. feeling right. like I'm being thumbs left up. alone. Thumbs you know, up. people don't realize what I'm helping them yeah. to do Come on. here. Come on. Every day you pray, you are doing works of faith. Amen. Wow. You cannot see God, but every day you speak to God. What do you think that is doing? It's going to make the reality of God mm. become so normal for you to speak with God that you start to have encounters wow. with God. Wow. 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 Amen. If you do it consistently, systematically, mm. with the right intention, with the right heart, mm. right, right. with the right mind, with the right strength, mm. that's why God says, seek me with all your heart, with all your strength, you'll find me. Yeah. Yeah, so amen. the reason why God has not appeared to you yet mm -hmm. is because you are praying with your mind. 
Maybe your heart has not caught up. Wow. Maybe all your might has not caught up. Yeah. Wow. But the more you do it, it's just like a muscle. Your left hand might be weaker than your right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But the more you keep working out, you start realizing that your left hand also became strong. Yeah. Yeah. Then before you know it, when you start lifting heavy things, you realize that you're not relying on the right as much. Mm -hmm. It is now become balanced. Mm. Yeah. That even when people look at you, your weakness of your left hand will be stronger than somebody's hey, right hand. Hey, wow. hey, hey. Mm. That's good. Yeah. I'm giving too many mysteries. Let that's me stop. Good. That's good. Help that's us. good. Help us. Every time you worship, mm. you are doing works of faith. Mm. But if you do it just like a routine, you're just like somebody who's going to work clocking in and clocking out. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. You are in a cycle. Yeah. You have not broken the mold. This is why you need to understand what you're working towards spiritually. Mm. Wow. If you don't understand what you're working towards spiritually, yeah. you're deceiving yourself. Wow. Somebody did not hear me. That's good. Amen. I'll say it one more time. I'll say it one more time. <laughs> If you don't know what you're working towards spiritually, mm -hmm. an example, when I, when I started, I perf le let me tell you the truth. Yes, God Papa. can, even though God can give you the gift of prophecy, God will not perfect it. It wow. is your duty to have mastery over it. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's good. If God gives you the gift of healing, mm -hmm. it is your duty to perfect it. God is responsible for the gift. It is your responsibility to perfect it. An example is, I love going shooting. Mm -hmm. It's one of my favorite things to do. It's not the only thing, but it's my f one of my favorite things to do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The reason why I love it is because every time I go to the range, I am perfecting my ability to shoot, to hit the target. Amen. Mm -hmm. Consistently, continually. Mm -hmm. If I take time off, my aim also mm -hmm. takes a vacation. Yeah. Same thing with fighting. Everybody knows I've, I post videos of it all the time. Yeah. I love doing MMA. Yeah. When I take time off, ah, we, I, I even know I'm rusty. Mm. You throw a jab and you're like, hey, why is it feeling like <laughs> slow motion? But when you're on, everything is there. Why? Because you are perfecting the skill. Amen. The hands have already been given. Mm. You just have to sharpen the skill. Amen. So with everything that God gives you, Deep. Yeah. If you don't take time to perfect it, mm. I don't care how many fastings you do. Mm. Wow, wow, mm. wow. <laughs> you know, there are people who go to the gym. Okay, let me show you how fake works look like. Mm. There are people who go to the gym to escort other people. In fact, gyms make more money from people who never use their gym membership. Yeah. Right, <laughs> yeah. And they know their peak season, so they will make more attractive offers the mm -hmm. beginning of the year mm -hmm. right. and before summer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There are people who are delusional. Summer, <laughs> summer body or in the summer. I'm going to work on my summer body in the <laughs> summer, 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 summer and I'm going to go to the beach. <laughs> so you, it's already too late. Yeah. Yeah. By the time you even have one pack, summer is over. <laughs> that is if you stay consistent. Yeah. People who have summer bodies, they started in January. By the time summer is coming, mm -hmm. all they're doing is maintaining. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. So gyms know, you will notice the best deals are in the beginning of the year because they want the fools that don't use their membership <laughs> to come and sign up mm. so that they can make free money. Yeah. Yeah. So they know the busy gym will be busy yeah. mm -hmm. the first month after mm -hmm. that it will decline, but people will still be charged. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Deep. And then there are people who stay with it, but they don't really go to work out. Mm -hmm. They'll go there, they'll do one. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a workout today. Okay. <laughs> and they go home. <laughs> they'll do one push up, they go in the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> they're delusional. Yeah. Yeah. 
because they don't want to pay the price that develops, then they will see somebody who is fit. They will say, hey, how? Uh, I remember one time I went with the, <laughs> my son West to the gym. And we went to the gym and <laughs> we were doing, uh, what's it called, uh, dips, right? Is it what, you were there too. You, we were doing dips. And then this one guy was just like, yo, man, I, wa I want to go. I want to, like, yo, you, you guys are like, how long do you guys have? Then there was another guy on the other side. The other guy was super, this guy was a gymnast. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The guy was doing flips, body <laughs> up and everything. This guy was like, man, I got to go, man. Then when that guy moved out, he made a whole thing. He went there, five. Yeah, that's. <laughs> I was like, my friend, you should have left that man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we need deliverance, yeah. I'm telling yes, you. Yes, yes. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Amen. You see some people, <sighs> they only jog to film themselves on Instagram. <laughs> then after that, they... <laughs> <laughs> But if you really look at them, when you really are ready to actually run, you realize they don't run for anything. <laughs> wow. But on Instagram. <laughs> rise and shine, don't be sleeping. <laughs> Get it done. <laughs> brand new, brand on new opportunities. <laughs> but in reality, they have not gone after anything. Dead works. That is dead works because it doesn't add unto anything. Right. Wow. The difference between spiritual works or works of faith mm. is that every achievement you have, it's a building block that stays. Mm. Wow. Mm. <sighs> Read the next verse. And he took him by the right hand and lifted him up. Why did he take him by the right hand? Because the guy did not believe he could stand. Mm. Remember, did this guy ask for a miracle? No. Uh, I, I can't hear. Uh, Grace, no. Grace is not responding. <laughs> I, did he ask for a miracle? No. no. I can't hear you. No. no. Uh -uh, did this man at the beautiful no. gate ask for a miracle? No. no. People online maybe will answer better because <laughs> the people in here, they think I'm asking a trick question. Yes. There's no trick question about this. Yes. Did this guy ask for a miracle? No. no. What did he want? Elms. What did he want? Silver and gold. What did he want? Silver and gold. Did he want anything to do with healing? No. no. Meaning that you can give people healing by force. Mm. Oh wow. my goodness. If you have mastery of faith, it will profit people that don't even want it. Wow. That's it is good. like meeting somebody that is struggling. You say, ah, I'm tired of seeing you in this condition. Here's money. Go, go, go get new clothes. Amen. Amen. They didn't ask you, but you just say, you know what? Let me help you. Yeah. yeah. Amen. Let me do something for you. Go feed wow. your family. Wow. Yeah. Go pay your rent. Oh my gosh, thank you. Your God said, yes, yes, yes. Go do something. Mm. Because you have the ability to control Amen. what God gave you. Thank Amen. You, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Be fruitful. Multiply. Yeah. And subdue the earth. If you have no control of the faith you have, you have no faith. Mm. Wow. 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 You are lying. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody didn't hear what I said. Mm. Hello. 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 I wish somebody could hear me. Mm. Facebook, are you there? I wish more people would keep sharing. Yeah. Share, share, people share. keep sharing, keep share, sharing, keep share. sharing, keep sharing. Facebook and YouTube keep sharing. Amen. I need more thumbs up. I need more thumbs up. I need more thumbs up. Yes. More thumbs up. Let somebody be blessed by this video. Amen. Yes, amen. amen. You know one thing that you realize? The closer you get to God, you realize how much work you need to develop yourself because God won't do that. Mm -hmm. wow. You see, yeah. your spiritual man is already where God is. Mm -hmm. What you're working out is your soul to get to where the spirit is. Mm -hmm. And in the process of developing your soul, mm -hmm. 
you are giving your body the discipline to carry out the will of the soul when your spirit commands. Wow. Yeah. So Eish. unless your soul has reached where your spirit is mm -hmm. and your body has reached where your soul is, mm. faith is not working. Mm. Jesus. Wow. Jesus. Jesus. Mm. It's like having an electrical wire that is disconnected and disconnected again. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter if the first wire is producing electricity. Mm -hmm. This part and this part will never get it because this wire has not been moved mm -hmm. to the top wire. Yeah. And this other wire has not also been lifted to the top wire for them to have a direct line. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The power of God flows through your spirit, your mm -hmm. inner man. Amen. Mm -hmm. Your inner man is the one that is carrying what God has. Amen. The problem is your inner man cannot produce what God has given because if he produces it, the soul has no ability to capture it because the soul has been disconnected from the spirit. Yeah. Wow. And if maybe if the soul even gets a glimpse of it, the body is disconnected from the soul. Yeah. This is why you know I need a six pack, but your body is saying, let's just sleep in. It's not even necessary. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder. <laughs> now I'm just telling you the truth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. She, he's gonna love you for who you are. You don't need to do anything. She's gonna love you for who you are. You don't need to do anything. It's deception. Yeah. Yeah. Why wouldn't you want to be the best version of you that when somebody meets you, he meets the best version Amen. of you could ever Amen. be? Amen. Amen. That's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm. Why not? Right. Why do you want to give a mediocre version of you to somebody mm. Mm. that wow. you yourself you would not want to be with? Mm. Wow. 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 wow, 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 that's good. That is powerful. Yep. Mm. Yep. I'm just being honest. Yeah, that's good. Some of you, you would not date yourself. Mm. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Some of you, you would not marry yourself, I'm telling you. If you met yourself, you say, oh God, I pray for that soul. <laughs> Let them find you. <laughs> I'm just being honest. Right. Amen. Right. Uh, me, I will, I will love me. Yeah. If I met me. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Amen. Would you live with you? Yeah. Some of you tolerate yourself. If you even are somebody who can do somebody something the wrong way and be okay with it and sleep, you are living, the, you are living below what you're supposed to be. Yeah. Mm. Wow. You do something without excellence and you're okay with it. Well, it is what it is. It's whatever. You don't love yourself. Yeah. Yeah. But you expect somebody to come and love this. It is what it is. Yeah. Mm. 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 Wow. Jesus. That's good. This yeah. is wrong. Oh, yeah. oh, yes, Papa. You're helping us, Papa. And then you go in church on Sunday, lift your hand and say, Lord, remember me. Mm. God is saying, I want to forget you. <laughs> <laughs> because I will not give my son or daughter you. I'll be giving wow. them a demon. Oh, wow. I'm serious. Yeah. Yes. Some people have become torment to other people because they never develop themselves mm. wow. to be the best version of themselves. Yeah. They Come enter on. somebody's life Come and on. they torment their Come life. Yeah. Somebody was doing well, their credit you mess up. Wow. Somebody was doing well, you ruin their life. Wow. You put trauma in their life. Ah, uh ah, -uh, you should have Come stayed on. away. Yeah, wow. yeah, yes, amen. Uh -huh. That's good, that's, that's good, deep. Papa. Hey, hey, hey. Wow. Some of you, you need to run from certain people. Yes. Not walk, run. Yes. Wow, wow, wow. Sprint, yes. no jogging. Mm. Jogging, they might catch up. Run. <laughs> Sprint. Wow. Hussein Bolt. Jesus. Hussein <laughs> Bolt. That's good. So if you don't develop yourself, you don't love yourself. Somebody should meet you and say, wow, I want to be like that person. Wow, I want to walk like that person. Wow, I look up to my husband. Oh, I look mm. up to my wife. I look up to my boyfriend. I look up to my girlfriend. Man, I can't wait. You make yeah. somebody raise their standard of life. Amen. Amen. Because of how well you care for yes. yourself. Yes, yes. Amen. That's somebody true. who cannot do that, cannot do that spiritually. Amen. Wow, 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 wow. Mm -hmm. wow. This is life changing. Yeah. And the Bible says, love your neighbor as you love yourself. The reason why you choose the wrong people is because you're still the wrong version of you. Mm. Oh. So you're loving the mediocre version of you. Wow. Wow. 
Because you can only love a version of you that you see in people. Mm. Wow. That's wow. Good. Wow. That's good. Wow. Wow. That's good. Wow. Mm. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. Meaning that you will always go after people that you are like. Are like. Mm. Wow. It, is ve- it is by God's grace for your eyes to be opened. To meet somebody that is advanced. That you also start working towards that place. And you start being attracted to another level. That Amen. will cause you to lift your level to match that level. Mm. Amen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Do you realize God says come as you are but don't remain as you are? Yeah. Mm. Wow. Yeah. God will give you tools to develop yourself. Mm-hmm. 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 But if you don't develop yourself, you'll never benefit from God the way somebody who has developed themselves. Yeah. Wow. This is a big lie that Christianity has. Yes. People have this lie that, oh, we are all equal. No, we are not. Yeah. I'm definitely not like a lot of you. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I'm yeah. being honest. Thank God. Yeah, thank you. Right. Oh, yeah. Hopefully some of you are better. Mm-hmm. But the reality is we are not the same. It's a lie. Yeah. It's a complete lie. Amen. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's a complete lie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll say it again. It's a complete what? Lie. Lie. Mm -hmm. It's a lie. lie. In the words of Guru, it's a lie. (laughs) (laughs) You lie. (laughs) (laughs) It's fake. Do you realize God has given us the best life? Because he loved himself. Mm. He gave us the best version of him as a man, Jesus. Mm. Wow. Yes. He Thank never lowered God. his standard. He gave us that standard. Amen. And we are called to be conformed to the image of Christ. That's works of faith. If every day as a believer you're not waking up trying to be like Jesus, mm. you are failed. Wow. Mm. Come on. Right. Wow. Jesus. I'm just being honest. Yes, yes. The reason why, you see, the reason why, let me tell you. (laughs) Listen, Uh I know, I know by the spirit and physically how deep I am. Amen. Why don't I come every day and prophesy? Why don't I come every day and do healing and stuff? Yeah. Not because I can't. I absolutely have done it many times. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right. Even though I'm waiting for the church. Ah, I'm yes. waiting for the building. Yes. Amen. 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 I'm waiting for us to be in church. Yes. Amen. But I'll tell you the truth. Is I know by the spirit what I can do. Yeah. Why do I teach more? Because I don't want people who want quick a, a pyramid scheme. <laughs> quick solutions things. Yes. No, I yes. want people to be developed. Because if I ever was taken by the Lord... Mm-hmm. And you never left with you are never left with something that you can pass on to develop other people. I failed. Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. If I just came with a lot of prophecies, but I never gave you something mm-hmm. that you can develop to be like me and better, and you can pass on that lesson to somebody else. Yeah. Let me tell you, you, go on our YouTube, you go on our on our Facebook. Treasures of teachings. Yes, yes. yes. That's yes. True. Thank you, guys. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to be known as the greatest prophesier. Mm-hmm. I want to be known as the greatest teacher. Amen. Yeah. I really do. Hallelujah. Why? Because a teacher is responsible for the future. Amen. Mm. Yeah, wow, that's wow. good. Amen. Thank you. Mm-hmm. That is what was Jesus called? Good teacher. Right. He changed people. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That 12 men who had no direction in life, they were going the wrong way. They became the greatest leaders that to this day we are benefiting from what they did. A tax collector, a fisherman, a doctor, a a, a farmer. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Men changed Mm -hmm. by reason of his words, not miracle. Yes. Miracles are amazing. Mm-hmm. Amen. They are great. Mm-hmm. Mm. This is why when people just want a, a miracle, they want this, they want mm. that. Mm, me, you turn me off. Mm. I want people who are interested in who Jesus is. Oh. Yeah, 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 people yeah. who are interested in how heavenly things work. Yeah. Yes. People who are interested in how they can meet God, encounter God. Yeah. People who can manifest and become a blessing mm-hmm. to their people. That's what I'm interested in. Anyone who's curious about the things of the spirit, Mm. 
you, 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 you put me on overdrive. Mm. Amen. There is nobody who asks me questions that I don't want to answer them. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Amen. I love questions mm. because I, it, it motivates something in my spirit mm. to speak. Mm. But if Amen. somebody just said prophesy to me, ah. Mm. Mm. I went to the restaurant, uh, when was it that we went to the restaurant? Um, I believe it was Thursday. It was Thursday. I went with them to the restaurant after we came from the gym. We sat in a booth, there was another booth behind us. I told them, God told me that the man sitting behind us is from this country. Tell him these words. He will turn to you and tell you, man, how did you know this? You answer him that I've been to that country to film. <laughs> I already gave him an answer because I knew what the guy was going to say to him. <laughs> so, so my son Todd turns and tells him, uh, are you from this country? The man said, yeah. And then he said something in the dial. I don't even know that language. The guy is speaking. I was given words I'm giving. Jesus. The guy answered him in his language. He said, hey, man, how did you know? He said, uh, uh, you know, I shot something. There is, man, I've been telling people that's the best place, man. Man, respect, respect. <laughs> I was just trying to show them that my gift works anywhere, anytime I want. Wow. Yeah. The disciples of Jesus never said, Lord, who can we follow that has great miracles? Yeah. They said, Lord, who can we follow? Who has the words of life? Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 Who has the words of what? Life. life. Mm. Not who has the greatest power. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because your power and anointing is fake if you don't have the word of God. Mm. Wow. Mm. We must wow. question wow. where your power is coming from. Mm. My daughter, keep Sorry. reading. Now listen to this. And he took by the right hand and lifted him up. Uh -huh. And immediately his feet and ankle bones received strength. Immediately. Because he did not just say receive it because he knew the guy wouldn't get up. He grabbed him and pulled him up and the guy got up. Now some people have tried to lift people off wheelchairs by force. <laughs> listen, if you don't have it, don't attempt it. You'll be sued. Yes, yes. In today's world, they will sue you for no reason. Yes. <laughs> wow. That's true. Uh, <laughs> my daughter Eileen, yes. now go there. Great grace. <laughs> go, go back to where we were. James 2. James 2.14. Listen to this now. What doth it profit, my brethren, uh -huh. though a man say he had faith uh -huh. and have not works, uh -huh. can faith save him? Can faith, so faith must begin by saving who? You. you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's good. Faith, if your faith cannot save you, it cannot save another. Because you cannot produce what you don't have. Mm. Yeah. So the number one thing you have to make sure, can your faith create the life, create the blessing that you want that you can also give it to somebody else? Mm. Wow. I cannot give you water that I don't have. Mm -hmm. okay. mm. yeah. I cannot give you knowledge that I don't have. Yeah, yeah. If somebody tells you how to do something but they have that information, they never did anything, question that the source. Mm. Mm. Question the source. Mm -hmm. yeah. Amen. Keep going. If a brother or sister be naked. And this, this is, I love this part. Now you will understand this properly. If a brother or sister be naked. Keep going. And destitute, destitute of daily food. Uh -huh. And one of you stay unto them. Uh -huh. Depart in peace. Uh -huh. Be ye warmed and filled. Uh -huh. Notwithstanding ye give them not those things which are needful to the body. What does it profit? Stop right there. This is today's church. <laughs> <laughs> I declare restoration. <laughs> Nobody is being restored. Oh, yeah. mm. I declare healing increase. Jesus. <laughs> and and this one, this one, this ones are usually in posts. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. The Lord said, <laughs> your breakthrough is at hand. Yeah. The Lord said, don't give up. I hear abundance, <laughs> but them themselves, they have none of those things they are saying. Mm. Yeah. What you're saying is false. Yeah. Wow, yeah. wow, 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 wow. wow. Because yeah. the sound of abundance can be heard by somebody that has abundance. Oh wow. wow. my God. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hey, you're mm -hmm. teaching good, Papa. Mm -hmm. The sound of open doors can be heard by somebody that has already opened a door. Mm -hmm. You can never hear a dimension you've never touched. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Wow. The wow. Lord said he's yeah. giving millions to people. You, you don't even have $10. You're lying. 
Jesus. What does the million sound like in the spirit for you to know God is giving millions? Right. Mm. Mm. Yeah. I'm telling yeah. you the truth. Amen. Yeah. That's good. Mm. Let me, I want you to read something. I'm going to show you a text message. And I want you to, I want you to read something. Mm. Oh, so, hey, my dad just called me, sorry. Uh, hold on. Let me try and call Baba. Amen. Dad? Daddy, I'm live. I'm, I'm super live. You are live right now? I am live, Dad. Uh-uh. Uh-huh. <laughs> That's why I feel a strong anointing. Ah, I receive. Uh, 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 Baba, I just wanted you. Where are you going to again? I'll tell you after like. (laughs) Uh, No, I was just ministering something. And I wanted you to, 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 you told me something last year. And I want to share it with people, to just show people that, first of all, he told me something. He told me two years ago, he said, son, you will never be able to produce people that will be in the millions unless you yourself, you enter into that dimension. Amen. Amen. Because if you don't touch that dimension, you can never produce it. Amen. And then he told me something. I'm giving you the ability to enter this place. I receive. And then he told me next year, mm. I see somebody giving you this amount. I don't know if you can remember, yes, Papa. Yes. You said somebody will call you. They will give you a million towards a project yes. and other people yeah. also give towards a project. Amen. God wants you to be wise that when the time comes, you be wise. And this is the exact number of what will be needed. Amen. Every single thing that he said happened. Hey, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Uh, God is extra deep. God is extra deep. Jesus. So what I'm trying to explain to people is that uh, I'm trying to explain to them that works of faith when you give your tithe, when you're giving your offering, mm-hmm. you are triggering works of faith. You're not triggering dead works. Mm. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are empowering your faith right. that what you declare begins to happen mm-hmm. Amen. because you have charged your faith. So if you say you're going to succeed, it's because you have paid the price for people to succeed Amen. because you yourself, you have succeeded. Amen. Ish. I, I, I don't know if you have something to add, Baba, and then, and then I know you're at the airport. There are three millionaires that I know in the Old Testament. Yes. Abraham, mm-hmm. Job, mm-hmm. and Solomon. Mm-hmm. Amen. True. Abraham came out from his father's house mm-hmm. into a land of his assignment. Yes. That's what prospered him. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. That means many people that are still under their fathers or their mothers physically, mm-hmm. they can break forth into a realm of millionaires. Yes. And I'll explain why. Mm-hmm. Number two, Job became a millionaire and nobody suffered more than him. Mm-hmm. Meaning it is people that will go through persecution, suffering for Christ, that can break forth into that realm. Mm-hmm. Number three, Solomon is the richest up to today. Mm-hmm. But you understand that Solomon only received favor from the Lord. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. favor qualifies someone that is not worth mm-hmm. Me and you, we know, mm-hmm. we already broke out from our fathers and our mother's place when we were young. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That means we already qualified. Mm-hmm. Number two, we suffered. Mm. A lot mm-hmm. for Christ. Mm-hmm. We have been called names, we have been persecuted, we have been bruised, we have mm-hmm. been walked upon, we have mm-hmm. been talked about, and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. But now we got into a level of favor. Mm-hmm. We are in 2022, mm-hmm. two, which is four. Mm-hmm. And the Bible says, and Jesus grew in favor mm-hmm. with men mm-hmm. and with God. Mm-hmm. Uh, I don't have much time to explain about the, the favor and the fourth dimension, but what I can confirm with you is everything that is happening with you was mm. written before mm. you were born. Mm. Mm. There are people wow. that may be listening to my voice right now. Mm. Wow. Right now. 
Mm. I taught yesterday in my group and people emptied their account. Mm. They emptied their account mm. because of the fire that was in the teaching. Mm. And I also believe right now we have the building project there. Mm. Some have given a million, some are giving hundreds of thousands. Mm. I believe there are people that God is pushing into emptying their account. No yeah. matter there's a dollar. Mm. or there is 50,000, mm. or there is something in the savings. Mm. Mm. It is that emptying, son, I don't know, I feel like mm. Professor Nolan. Mm. It is that emptying of the account mm. that when you no longer have any way to depend on that God, mm. God will prove to you that it's very easy to be a millionaire. Yes, you saw the check that I received, I think it was three, yeah, three years ago. Yes, yes, I remember. The Jamaican president wrote me a check for seven million. Yes. I didn't work for it. Yes. I didn't pray for it. In fact, but you prophesied it, it in the I beginning emptied, of the year. Jesus. Yeah, I've emptied my account more than five times, seven mm. times. I gave a house. I mm. gave a lot of cars. The time just came, favor happened. Seven million came to me. Mm. There are people mm. that are listening to my voice right now mm. that God is putting into millions, mm. not for them, Ka for the sake of the gospel. Laba yeah. But yeah. it starts yeah. with them emptying their account. Someone will say, I've been giving to the church or I've been partnering with the building, but yes. this is a prophetic call yes. for somebody to empty the account right now. Someone mm. is going to write a check as I speak. Mm. Someone is going to write a check. Someone is going to do something early in the morning. Yes. Empty their account. If I see about people coming to lay offerings, mm. checks, mm. seeds into mm. your feet, and Kaya, their lives will never be. In fact, in the realms of the spirit, there are 27 people. Mm. God is calling in the realm of emptying their account. Akura maike kia kosuma mahase. Nainjia ko venanjo langisto vak mahase. Elomongra de bonsa. It's like in the spirit, I'm seeing the angel of finances and I feel like speaking with it financial tongues. They cover Sandra Kizo, Elemento Lito, Ekemisten Shine Mengle Kiza Brahata, Indo Vastic Bank of Foconista Ak, Melinosto Paradiesta, Paracuva Santa Legista, Paracuva Sai, Saidi, 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 million shearing of the Divine World Bank in the plastic of the Birionstein pounds, pounds, pounds of the Ekron, the Stikra, Askina, Uri, Nesto, Paracadia, Uri, and the Stekebia Angai, Euros of Enemy Kesikadai, Ye Solomon of the City of Giombian Stek. I There is someone God is calling to sweat seed of a hundred thousand. I see someone giving hundred thousand. I see about twenty seven people emptying their account. Within the next 24 hours, there are people that God is speaking to. There are people God is raising. There are people that love you that are coming to show. I see someone giving a car. I see someone also giving a house. Million series, in the name of Sidon King, million dollars of Brain and Mest and V, Akio Mighty and Train and Moss, pretty one, Sanahagi, Sanamahak. There are people that God is raising in this broadcast to build the church for Christ. And I hear the Lord saying, It is the time and it is done. Amen. 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 It is the time and it is that. Thank you, Papa. I will be back. I'll be back in America next week. Okay. Amen. Okay, Papa. Please we'll talk later on that. Okay, I'll message you. You have my blessing. Thank you, Papa. You Thank my you. Blessing. Thank you, Papa. Amen. Amen. Jesus. Ah, now he's put me in another dimension. Hey. Amen. Come on, Papa. Power. Hey. Mm. You see. When God opens a door mm. for you to hear a certain word, it's do you realize that favor is not just the expediting ability, but it is the platform you've been given. Mm. Amen. Right now, you are empowering your faith because you have been favored to know the truth about how faith works. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. 
that in itself is favor. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. That in itself is the might of favor itself. Mm -mm -mm. This is what I want to do because I want to maintain what uh, Papa just did. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you where we are with the church project now. Amen. Amen. And maybe I'll come back and I'll build on this, but I feel in the spirit that I should do what uh, the Father just said. Amen. 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 Let me tell you something. Where we are is this now. We put in our offer for the property. Amen. And uh, there are other people that also put their offer in. So we are now in a place whereby we need you to pray mm. dearly. Yes. Because I believe these people have already favored us. They really actually want us to have it. Amen. Amen. But they are going to counter. They already said we want to counter your offer. But there are other people who also have put offers. Mm -hmm. So whoever is going to match what they want is the one they're going to go for, hey, with because... Hey, hey, hey. That is where we are. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What we need now, it is not impossible. We need you, number one, to pray yeah. seriously that God will cause us to be the ones that will have influence to get what is needed. Mm. Amen. Number two, we need one million. Ooh. At least. In reality, we need 1.5. If we don't have that, we'll not be able to, if they counter us, we'll fall off. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Is it impossible? Absolutely not. Yeah. People have given that amount. Yeah. Yeah. People have given more than that amount. Yeah. We need, because when you see this place yourself, you'll understand why it is very important for us to fight for it. Yeah. Amen. I want you right now, mm. I want you right now, and he's going to put all the giving information on the side. I want you right now to work your faith to say, Lord, I'm going to give my best to see this work come to fruition. If 10 people who have the ability to do 100 do it, 15 people, we are even in a more safer place. Amen. But at least... At least on the lowest side. Mm -hmm. But there's no need even for us to say the lowest side. Let's go to the uh, optimum side. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 1.5. Yes, yes, yes. We close this thing and it is hey. possible. Hallelujah. This will be a place of refuge. It will be a place of redemption. It will be a place of change. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But we need you to support this thing now. Mm -hmm. Amen. Pray number one that they will be gravitated towards us. Number two, Hallelujah. we need that amount for us to be able to make this happen. If we don't get that amount, it will pass us by. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I don't want it to be the case. Mm. I want you, whether you're using wire transfer, whether you're using Venmo, whether you're using paper, I want you to do it prayerfully. Amen. And I want you to believe not only my word as a prophet, but believe my father, the prophet, yeah. who said whoever will actually go to the step and say, I'm going to take my sacrifice, I'm going to empty and do this towards God. I promise you God will never uh, leave you to be ashamed. Amen. I have done this myself and I can testify to you. Mm -hmm. Yes. Me myself, me myself, I've given towards the project. Yes, Papa. Mm -hmm. I actually have. Mm -hmm. They Amen. know what I have done. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. Amen. Amen. They know what I have done. I've myself, mm -hmm. I, I didn't leave it to anybody, myself. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I took <laughs> the biggest <laughs> chunk that I could yes, and I put Papa. it in there. Right, right. And God is my witness. Amen. And they that are here oh, yeah. are my witness. Yes, yeah. Big time. Yeah, yeah, and when we close, maybe I will tell you what it was that I did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I want you to do the same thing. Amen. Get your best because we need this for the glory of God. Amen. Amen. I want you to go right now to the PayPal, to the Venmo, to the wire transfer. If you do a wire, please take a screenshot, send it to me so that we can honor you and thank God for you. Amen. I want you to do it now and God will honor you. I want people to do it right now. Amen. I want you to play the image of the church on one side and, and people to give and let's do it and then we'll come back and pray. Amen. Let's, let's go. You are the...
This is Prophet Lovi Elias, and I welcome you to our vision. You are the same on God on how you reign. Oh Lord, you give me peace like a river. You are the same God, you never change. And when the whole world is lost in darkness, I have your comfort, I'm not afraid. I will be singing. From the mountains Cause you're the same God You never change You never change You never change You, you never change Thank the Lord Jesus for this great opportunity to acquire this amazing church home for you and your families and for our children and for our community and for this city. I want you to partner with this vision. God wants to touch the world through this place. I want you to give the best that you can towards this goal and I promise you, God will forever remember this act. When Solomon built the house of God, that wall to this day stands as a memorial. Whoever cries at the wailing wall to this day, God answers them for the sake of Solomon. So I want God to answer people's prayer for your sake also. Every soul that will be won in this house will be also credited to you. Every healing, every deliverance, it will be as if you served God with the prophet to make this happen. I want to promise you, that everything you give towards this goal will rise as a memorial before the God of glory. I want you to partner with this vision. I want you to give your very best for the kingdom of God and for the sake of many souls. Believe it or not, God dwells in me and he dwells in you. But God, according to the scriptures, he also wants a house. When David spoke and said, Lord, I desire to build you a house, God was so moved because nobody had ever offered him a home to stay in physically. When you build a church, you make a place that people can have an appointment with God. God is everywhere, but he cannot be met everywhere. So this will be a place that you can come and cry to God and God will hear you because God will be housed in this house. I bless you in the name of Jesus. I want you to go and give your best towards this vision. Jesus loves you. I love you and see you soon in this home. Shalom. This is Prophet Lovi Elias and I welcome you to our Vision 2020. Come on in.
thank the Lord Jesus for this great opportunity to acquire this amazing church home for you and your families and for our children and for our community and for this city. I want you to partner with this vision. God wants to touch. This is Prophet.
know what the problem is I know you can get me out of it I can always count on you I'm yours and I'm proud of it Show me your grace Show me your ways I'm seeking after you Show me your face I wanna know more Keeping it 100, I was running, I was running Had to run the hard way But you always up to something If you said it, then it's done I know it every time I pray It's done He made a way, for real I was down bad, I cast, he changed the way I live, I've been riding around, I'm on too long Jesus, take the wheel, take control I know my fate is sealed He made a way, for real I was down bad, I cast, he changed the way I live, I've been riding around, I'm on too long Jesus I'm on a mission, I gotta finish, yeah Made a commitment to go to distance, yeah Made in his image, I can't diminish, yeah I'm about his business, I gotta witness, yeah Every second and every minute, yeah As long as he with me, I got no limits, yeah Man, I'm so dependent, gotta admit it, yeah The burden been lifted, so I ain't tripping, nah no. Nah, no. that's why I'm true to this Had to put a moment, I had to bring the crew in it Ain't no way to ruin it, it just keep on renewing it I rock the Gucci with the gold crucifix switch Oh no, he ain't through with me, yeah I won't walk over See all my days, all I can say He made a way, for real I was down bad, I cast, he changed the way I live, I've been riding around, I'm on too long Jesus, take the wheel, take control I know my fate is sealed He made a way, for real I was down bad, I cast, he changed the way I live, I've been riding around, I'm on too long Jesus I, I really thank God for everybody that is sacrificing. Listen, this is something that God has given us. And this is something that God wants us to work towards. Amen. This is our action of faith to declare before God that, Lord, uh, we want to honor you with what you have blessed us with. And we want to honor you by building you a house. Amen. I want you to, even when you watch this later or tomorrow in the morning, I want you... I'll be back tomorrow morning and I want you to really sacrifice towards this. Amen. Really sacrifice towards this the best way that you can. This is not impossible. What we have already raised is actually really deep. Amen. But we need a little bit more. And what we are trying to raise, we, we already raised more than that. Amen. It's just what we are trying to get is, is we don't, you know me, I don't believe in mediocrity. I believe whatever we be give God must be the best we can give God. Yes. Uh, I, 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 I want, they're saying low sound. Is my sound low or is it good? Hello, hello, hello. Can you hear me? Okay. So whoever is giving, I want you to use the giving information that is on there. And also, uh, uh, and, and also, uh, uh, I want to mention a few people, but maybe we should do it tomorrow. What do you guys think? Tomorrow, right? I know I know, because of time, I don't want to keep a lot of people up, especially in the East Coast. But we'll be back tomorrow, and we are going to be working towards that number. Amen. We're going to be working towards that number. It's not an impossible number, especially if you know where we came from. Ah, it's not an impossible number yeah. at all. And it is very possible for us to make it happen. Amen. One person can make this happen. Yeah. Yeah. 10 people can make this happen. 15 Amen. people can make this happen. Yeah. If we had 15 people that would do 100,000, we are done. Yeah. It's, not, it's, not, it's, not, it's not impossible. It's not, 
Uh, it's not undoable. It's totally doable. Yeah. Yeah. One yeah. person can clear this whole thing. Yeah. My yeah. prayer is that God will touch you to realize what we are doing. Amen. Mm, I know, I know uh, my daughter Elias' generation, not Greg Grace, is here. <laughs> <laughs> come, come, come. Is it, come, come both. Is it just you or you and your brother? Come. Oh my gosh, it's you. Yes, oh my gosh. You and your you. brother, it's so awesome. Mm -hmm. Yes, um, so I just want to share the quick testimony just to hopefully inspire people. Mm -hmm. um, when you first did the, the meeting, the Zoom partnership, like, yeah, mm. I don't know if I'm in the... Yeah, you're, 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 you're in there. there. Don't yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I did what Baba said and gave mm. absolutely everything. And then you did the second one and we're like, okay, I really got to push myself. And I'm like, God, I, I want to sell 5,000. And mm. I don't even have a job mm. <laughs> at this yeah, time. Yeah, and I'm yeah. like, I just, I got to push myself. So I started moving things around. Um, Mama Peggy, I'm sorry. I put it on my credit card. <laughs> I'm going to pay it back. Um, and um, I cashed out some stocks. I just mm. started moving stuff about around. And I'm like, you know what? I'm so close to 5000 And I said, bro, will you partner with me? Because um, I want to give the 5000 And he came in. Mm. And then all I needed was $500. Mm. And then... Um, I had sent out emails to family and friends at the beginning, and um, my cousin reaches out on Sunday, and he's like, hey, is this email real or is this a scam? Mm. <laughs> I'm like, um, no, cousin, it's real. He's like, okay, well, I don't need a tax write-off, but um, it sounds like a good cause. I'll give you $500. Wow, wow. So wow. We, we made the goal, and um, my family like really came through, Like even was like, I should reach out to my sisters because mm. why not? Let's all secure our family, yeah, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So uh, we were able to, like, from our, our, fa our family to mm. my spiritual family to the future family to come, we mm. were able to do 5,500. Wow. Nice. So yeah. we, we gave most of it online, and we have 1,500 to give now wow. in cash. Extra deep. Yes. And, um, Extra deep. Extra deep. I also had this revelation, uh, again, to hopefully inspire people. Mm. Um, that and forgive me, it's cliche because my mm. name's Esther Rose. But I Whoa. had I had the revelation <laughs> that Mordecai said to his family. Um, mm. He said, uh, you know that uh, don't think that deliverance is going to come to the Jews, but don't think that your family, you know, will mm. be saved. And mm. who knows if you come to this, mm. you know, the kingdom for such a time as this. Mm. And, and forgive me for the cliche, but like the building, people are going to get. The building is going to get paid for and it's going to mm. happen. But mm. who knows if for this this moment, this such a time as this, that you got that bonus check. Yes. That you got yeah. that savings. That's deep. Yeah. That is that so like, deep. Like, you know, yeah. that for this moment to secure your family, to get this building that's going to mm. produce so much miracles and so many mm. great things for the kingdom of God. Mm. And, you know, just to push people to push themselves. And yes. that if you really have that desire, God's yeah. going to make it happen. Yeah, amen, amen. It's like very that, true. Um, I just want to share that. And my prophetic gift, you already have uh, a key. You already have a sign. You already have <laughs> bricks, <laughs> bricks and mats. Um, I brought your water. Oh, uh, deep. Three of them for the Holy Spirit, Father and Son. Uh, extra and deep. And of course it means um, the Holy Spirit and prophetic, but... It also represents that this will be a well that will never run dry. Oh, deep. And, um, yeah. Maluk, you are a prophet. Look at how people. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> ah. And people will never thirst the, again. She's the best, let me tell you. Great grace is deep. <laughs> the way she's cheering. Wow. The way she's cheering. That, that's my sister. That's. Ha! <laughs> ah. Even me, I feel jealous now. <laughs> yeah. Can I have somebody who will cheer for me like that? That's Amen. deep. Amen. That's Amen. extra prophetic. My sister's the best. So you yeah. know, in oh. fact, on that note, I will drink it. Keep going. I'm listening. Amen. So yeah, Amen. so people will never thirst again. Amen. So, uh, so well, will never will. Amen. 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 So Amen. I'm just grateful that my fa family was able this to This is extra. Through. This is powerful. Let me tell you something. Mm. Uh, the Bible says it like this. Jesus went to the well. And told the woman, give me what to drink. And the woman said, I have nothing. Uh, why would I give you water? I'm a Samaritan. Mm -hmm. Jesus said, if you knew who was asking you for water, you would ask him for water. Mm -hmm. And the water he would give you would never thirst. Then mm -hmm. the woman said, give me these waters. Jesus says, okay. Jesus began to prophesy. The true prophetic ministry is a well of water. Mm -hmm. Amen. The Holy Spirit is represented 
hovering over water. Mm. But water itself is the prophetic. Amen. Wow. Everything that you see in creation was because God prophesied, let there be. Mm. This, wow. is ex this is extra spiritual. Wow. Are you in the spirit? God. It's not cliche at all. You would have been cliche if you said, God will plant roses. I just see roses. <laughs> that, would be, that would be suspicious. <laughs> but this is deep. This is really powerful. And, wow. and I thank your brother. Nice oh, to see your brother. My brother sowed more than, I didn't count what he sowed that you've been uh, you Listen, I've been, I've been, I've, you know, so I've I been saying like, <laughs> I've just been sitting there saying, ah, this guy is killing it like this. Mm. Every single day, every single day. And I tell you this, to be honest with you, before God, there is no one who ever gave anything to God and God never elevated. Mm. It's just not true. Amen. I've never seen the righteous forsaken or, or their children beg for bread. Yes. When you do something for God, you remove the ability to beg, yeah. to want from your family. Mm. I know this for myself. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Mm -hmm. I know this for myself. Mm. And I know this by what my father and mother also did. Yes. Uh, I'm so grateful. This is extra deep. So tomorrow we'll be back on in the morning. I want you to fight to make this happen. Amen. Uh, I'm so glad. She flew from New York to just come and do this. Yes, yeah, specifically the water. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she flew amazing. from New York to specifically do this. Some people came from New Jersey. They didn't even... <laughs> I won't say anything. <laughs> I'll just keep quiet. But... She flew from New York to specifically do this. Yes. Amen. May God really honor you, your brother, your sisters, your cousin, and everybody connected. Amen. I pray that the blessing of God will come over both of you. Amen. Give me my oil. G get my oil. Get my oil. Get my oil. Get my oil as fast as you can. Amen. Lord Jesus. Father, I honor your children. I honor them, O oh Lord. Amen. I honor them, O oh Lord. Let this oil signify their elevation, their transformation. I pray, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus, what they could never achieve, let it be achieved by reason of this oil. Let it be achieved by reason of this oil. Those things that were not possible, I make them possible. I allow the rivers of living waters as they have prophetically signified. Father, I pour the blessing of a father from the bottom of my heart. Let it touch your people and let your people change, be changed forever. Beginning now. Through their hands, let their families be rescued. Let their faith work that people around them will be rescued. Mm. Let people be rescued. Let them be rescued. Let their faith never fail. In the mighty name of Jesus. It is done. I love you all and I will see you tomorrow morning. I bless you with the blessing of the Lord. In Jesus mighty name. Amen. Shalom and we will see you tomorrow. Bless you.